of Super Reaction Bros. I'm Kristen. I'm Christopher. And thank you, Internet, for ruining something. Um, ruining something because we get it early before E3. Now, yeah. of course, I'm talking about the first official reveal trailer for Spyro Reignited Trilogy. Yes. Now, for those who don't know, we're going to go who back, back in time a bit <laughs> to the <laughs> mid-90s when the two biggest platforming stars on PlayStation were Crash Bandicoot. And Spyro the Dragon. Dragon. Now, for those who don't know, Spyro Dragon was original. For those who think it's only Skylanders with the with the the, the purple thing. Yeah, it's um, those millennials. Okay, yeah. Uh, <laughs> you know, dads who were technically considered millennials. Whatever. But anyways, um, it it was three games that started off on the PlayStation, all done by Insomniac. Now a lot of people know Insomniac more in days for the Resistance series. Mm -hmm. And uh, doing the current Spider-Man game. Yeah. Exactly. As well, obviously, the Ratchet and Clank series. Yeah. Well, this is where they started. If you want to think one series, one original trilogy for giving us something like Ratchet and Clank, you have to think Spyro. Spyro was their original giant 3D the original platformer. Predator. Predecessor, yeah. yeah. So, that's why a lot of people were excited when, it's when we heard early buzz regarding them doing, like we did with the Insane trilogy, mm -hmm. doing a... A redo of the trilogy for um, Spyro. Spyro, yeah. And this is what we're getting now. It's it the re this remaster mm -hmm. or remake. I I you have to look up the differences. Um, mm -hmm. did they call the Crash one a remake? I'm not too sure. I don't remember. Ogo of remake. I I believe it's more of a remaster. Where they where they rebuilt it back up, but with it's still with the same well, tech style. Yeah, and this one's being developed by Toys for Bob, which. You may not know the name, but they are known for developing the Skylanders games. Yeah. And will be coming to the PS4 and Xbox One, but there's current rumors, as of this recording, there are current rumors that it will be hitting the Switch as well. But later on at some point? It's a rumor because I believe, um, I think one of the retailers have it listed for Switch as well, or something like that. So who knows, we may hear something at E3 for it. But I, di I did find out a bit more information. Mm -hmm. um, upgrade visuals, obviously. Yeah, obviously. Fully upgrade. I mean, we've seen the screenshots, so yeah. I mean, upgrade visuals. But also, this is what I found out, what's all happy with. They got, I believe they got a huge majority of the original voice cast back. Yeah, that's what I heard Including too. the original voice of Spyro, Tom Kenny. Yeah. I, wait, I think... Okay, I think he was Spyro for two and three, but the first one was um Carlos El Azarki. Yeah, and I know after two and three, after that, that's when pretty much they did one with Elijah Wood, pretty much. Cause yeah, we don't talk about any uh, any Spyros after the after, after the, the third year, one, the, year of the Dragon. Yeah, after the and, third one. Well, like I said, these will be full on whatever you like to call them, remakes, remasters of Spyro Dragon, Spyro Ripto's Rage, and Spyro Year of the Dragon. Yeah, so. Yeah, let's, let's just dive right into this and see what we're getting, see what we're, you know, see the changes or see how it looks the, this time around, even though we saw screenshots, but let's just see it in movement. So this, again, this is for a Spyro Reignited Trilogy, all scaled up reveal trailer. So here we go. Oh, the mu that's the other thing. The they music. said they are upgrading the music. They're um, actually re um, remixing the music as well the music. Oh, that is adventure. Music. All scale. Oh, oh look wow. at that! Wow, that is wow. That is fucking gorgeous. That is. Same <laughs> six hundred. Yeah. <laughs> Resolve 3. Oh! Man, I definitely want to get it. Oh, I'm already want it. I'm already getting it. Oh, yeah. <laughs> Spiral Reignite yeah, Trilogy. Yeah. September. I don't mean it visually looks gorgeous. Um, do you know that... Okay, remember the reaction we did to, um... A hat in time. Yeah, it has that feel to it visually. It does. It really does. Um, oh, the other thing I tried to bring up was there was this fun thing they did. Oh, a couple things. Yeah, there was this fun thing they did with journalists. For some journalists, like I believe like a month, like a few weeks ago, they sent the uh, Activision mailed out purple eggs 
to the journalist, teasing something coming, pretty much. Nice. That was really cool. Um, um, also, this year, cel- sorry, uh, one more thing. This year <laughs> celebrates the 20th anniversary of the series. Yeah, and um, another reason why, you know, we fully got into the series ourselves. Was, was the PlayStation demo disc. Well, not only the demo disc. And our sister. Mainly our sister, pretty much, because she was, when she was younger, uh, she was a huge fan. She loved the games pretty mm-hmm. much, so I'm pretty sure, hopefully, when she finds out about this, I know she'll probably be pretty excited to, yeah. to get it, pretty much, because it really, it was what really got her into gaming, if, I, if I'm correct. It yeah. really got pushed her all the way, the rest of the way through, it was, this, it was this game series. Yeah, for us, too. I mean, the three are considered one of the best, some of the best platformers yeah. on the original PlayStation and we can time, we yeah. can verify they are very good. They are all solid plat three D platformers for the most part. And these upgrade visuals look astounding. Yeah, they look. Amazing. It looks like they really took their time and built it back from the ground up like they did mm-hmm. with uh, the Insane trilogy. So yeah, I'm looking forward to it. It looks absolutely amazing, and I can't wait to get back into it for yeah, the most same part. Same here. I definitely want to get my hands on this already. I believe it's September 9th it that's comes what, out. I think, I think that's what I heard. September 9th. It, it comes out, I believe, a few days before or after the 20th anniversary, the actual day of 20th anniversary. Well, it's close enough, at least. Yeah. So. so, other than that, if you're new to the channel, you can hit the like button. If you want to talk some more about stuff like this, comment down below. If you want to share us around, share it around. And if you like it's just a little bit more than anybody else when it comes to talking about video games, hit the subscribe button down below and also hit that bell icon on the right hand side. Just let us know what you guys' thoughts are on this pretty much trailer. Just come back. Well, not come back, but at least remake or remaster. You could correct this down below. We don't care if we get it wrong. Like, just let us know down below how it's said to correct proper term. Um, any fond memories of, you know, you know, you pl- you playing it pretty much, you know, why you got into it, what makes you, what made you so excited for playing this series back in the day and what makes you excited to play it again this, this time around for this year? Let us know in the comments below. Put down what you thought of our reaction, but most importantly, thank you for watching. So until next time, I'm Kristen. I'm Christopher. And this has been a very spiral-filled episode of SRB. See you later. Hey guys, thanks for watching. If you want to check out any of our previous reactions, as well as our other shows, click the playlist down below. And if you want to check us out in the social universe, you can check us out on Twitter, as well as Stardust, at Super React Bros.